Hi guys, it's me Shruti and I know it's been a while making a video so this video is for you guys. I hope you enjoy this. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I am going to be making a frog origami. So let's get started with that. So, um, I'm going to take this um, piece of paper. So this is actually seven inches by three and a half inches. So, yeah. So right now, I think you are thinking to get a ruler and a pencil to measure every inch of the paper you have just to uh, get seven inches by three and a half inches. Well, none of that is needed. Just follow these steps and you'll get the right piece of paper. If you want to do it on a rectangular piece of paper, you have to actually fold it in half, like this. And then, what you're going to do is you are going to fold this part into a triangle. And you're going to take this and fold it like this. And then... Um, since our triangle ended like over here, we can just cut this part to that and we can just flip it and then we can um, fold it like this. Now we know how to cut it. So we have this whole rectangle to cut it. So, so let's get started with this. So first, um, you're going to have to fold, open it up, and fold it again. Tilt and do the same. And after you're done, you should be having a diamond. So it should look like this. And now, okay, so here comes the fun part. You take this tip of the corner and you're going to just fold it like that. And then you're just gonna have to fold it like this. And yeah. And then you can just um, overlap it like that again. And then you can just, you should be having this part again. And then you can just overlap it, I mean, just fold it on top like this and voila. Now you should have frizzles. Now you're going to do the same to the other side. You should be having, um, this and then what you're gonna do take this um, tip of the corner and you're gonna have to fold it upwards like this and do the same to all of them and just like that but we're not done yet so we're gonna take this tip of the corner and we're going to just do this just fold it like this, and yeah. So right now, it must be looking like some sort of a bug or something, but seriously, um, we have more steps, so yeah. So as you can see, we've made our frog legs, so it can actually really stand if we um, put the legs on. And now, now, we're going to take this, this um, tip and you're going to just fold it upwards again like this and then you're going to unfold this and going to make folds like this do, do the same to the other side so yeah and now you're going to take this fold that you folded upwards earlier and you're going to tuck this fold in. So you must be having like holes over here, two holes 
one over here and one of uh, one on this side. So you're gonna use those holes to tuck these big um, folds in. And you're gonna do the same to the other fold. There you have it, a frog, just kidding. So we have more steps to go. So um, you're gonna have to fold it like this. And voila. So yeah, and there you go. You have a small DIY origami frog. Ooh, so it can actually jump. If you want to add something more to your origami frog like eyes, here's how to do it. So take a small piece of white paper and then draw a small circle on one side and then cut it out. I um, cut it out. Then you might as well just draw some black dots in them. Next, you can glue it on the frog. It's all done, it just needs to jump now. I hope you guys loved this video. I worked really hard on it. And uh, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get new updates from Shruti Beast's creativity channel. Bye!